<laughs> All right, coming to the stage, I haven't seen this guy in a while, but I'm glad he's coming back. Get off for Mr. Tony Mack! DJ, you are late and wrong. Cut that shit off. Cut that shit off. You late. What's up, Hydra Gates? How we doing? We doing good? That's what's up. That's what's up. Where's my over 30 people at? Where we at? How, yeah. How, yeah. Hey, look. Over, over 30 people, realize that you're getting old. All right? You're getting old. I realize I'm over 30. I'm getting old, sir. I'm getting old. This is how I know I realize I'm getting old. I realized I gotta stretch every goddamn day, all right? I gotta do it, I gotta stretch every goddamn day. This is how I realized. Sir, I went out and did some real white people shit. I went out and played Ultimate Frisbee. And I didn't know that you could pull a hamstring and play an Ultimate fucking Frisbee. I pulled the hamstring and play an Ultimate Frisbee, sir. And I'm a thug. I just can't tell my friends that I pulled the hamstring and play an Ultimate Frisbee. My boy's like, hey fam, what happened to you? I got shot, um. I got shot, goddamn. Like, like, I realize, like, I'm trying to be a thug, but it don't work because white women are not scared of me. Like, I just re <laughs> Walking down the street, white women is like, hello, sir. I'm like, hi. <laughs> so dumb. Anybody, we're all dating? Anybody dating here? Yeah. Okay, single people? All right, where's single people at? Yeah. Hell yeah. Where my people that's dating? Where y'all at? Y'all do not sound happy. <laughs> you don't sound happy at all. Like I'm dating and it, I'm dating and it's weird because like I live with my girlfriend and it's weird because like we just don't agree on certain stuff. Like fellas, don't make the same mistake I did. I moved into my girl's place. Don't ever do that, all right? Don't ever do that. This this will happen to me, fam. Went into my girlfriend's house. I realized that my girlfriend doesn't have a fucking trash can. <laughs> So I'm like, trash can. I'm like trying to go some way. I'm like, babe, why don't you have a trash can? She's like, it doesn't go with my aesthetic. <laughs> and she's trying to like rationalize. She's like, trash cans are ugly. I'm like, bitch, you need a trash can. Like, what is like fucking retarded? Like, she's simple, y'all. Like, we argue about dumb stuff. Like, this is what we argue about. We're going to a grocery store, right? And walk into the grocery store and grocery shopping, and we're agreeing on everything, putting stuff in the cart, and we got to the port where I was like, hey, go ahead and pick up three avocados. She was like, avocados? She was just like, black people don't eat avocados. She was like, what? <laughs> Why was I noticed on this? The black people don't eat avocados? Like, <laughs> and she was like, sir, she was like, when did you discover avocados? I was just like, 2017. She was like, how did you discover it? I was like, a white woman. God damn it, she got me. She got me. She got me. Got me, goddamn. White women that, that are here, calling y'all out. I don't like when white women bring snacks to work. I don't like it. I don't know what it is. I don't like when stop bringing snacks. You look like the type to bring snacks to work. I don't know when it's stopping. Like, white women try to get everybody to eat the snacks and just like fucked up shit. Like, my coworker decided to one day come in. She's like, she brought everybody scones. I don't know if you had a scone before, but I've never had one. Everybody was eating it, and she's like, Tone, you're not gonna have one? And I was just like, no, black people don't eat scones. <laughs> she goes, how could you say that? That's racist. I was like, look, I've never seen one eat one. I'm not gonna be the first one. I might fucking explode or some shit. Like, what the fuck? I might explode from eating a scone. Like, and not, like, I'm like psychological, I'm like diabolical when it comes to this. I had to Google, I went on Google, and I Googled, do black people eat scones, right? <laughs> The first thing that pops up, Magic Johnson, black people don't eat scones, so I mean, <laughs> if Magic Johnson said it, then I think we're, I think we're okay, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I've been doing a lot of thinking, like, I don't know if you guys, clap it up, because we haven't had any mass shootings this year, clap it up, clap it up. Honestly, I'm waiting for another one, but hear me out, <laughs> hear me out. Like, because I feel like mass shooters aren't getting the right people, like, if they're gonna shoot somebody, I think they should shoot up people who work at like tow truck companies. <laughs> Yo, hear me out. Like y'all like y'all never got your car towed before. Like <laughs> whose car never got towed in here before? Whose car never been towed? Yeah. What kind of car do you drop, sir? Ford Edge. We got a Ford Edge parked at a lot of state theater. Tow his shit right now. <laughs> 
Sir, I don't know if your car, like, when they take your car, they can take your car so far. I don't know why they do that. Like, sir, it's retarded. Like, if they're going to tow my car, just take it to somewhere where it's free parking. <laughs> like, yo, like, take my car to the nearest Walmart, fam. I know I will get it from there. Like, you're trying to be $300, like, it's annoying. Like, it is funny. Thank you. That's, that, my car recently got towed. That's why I'm doing this fucking junk. I'm fucking pissed. Like, I'm so mad. Like, and like, when you need your car back, so when your car gets towed, you gotta go to the spot, get your car, they charge me $450, and I'm like, fuck, $450. And I just walked out. Like, after, after I paid the $450, I was like, damn, where's a mass shooter when you need one? Like, is that too dark? <laughs> like, all right. When I'm not doing comedy, I work as a salesman. I work for AT&T. If you need a phone, holla at your boy. Uh, I'm plugging myself. <laughs> it's a fun job. Like, like I get annoyed though, like working at my job because we get a lot of old people that come in here, and I've realized old people with technology just don't mix. Like, I don't know what it is. Like, you here right now, young, young person, help your fucking grandparents out because they're lost. Like, I don't know what it is. They're lost, man. Like, this lady comes to my job, man. She had to be like 107. Um, she walks in. She's like, Hey, I see the deal on TV, and I want to get a new smartphone. And I'm like, okay, cool. What kind of phone do you have right now? Out of her purse, she pulls out a cordless house phone. <laughs> can't make this shit up. Like, really pull it out. Like, fam, you can't go from a home phone to iPhone. It don't work like that. You gotta go back to the basics. Like, you gotta start with a Nokia phone with the game Snake on it. That's where the fuck you gotta start. You just can't jump skip. Like, what's wrong with you? Like, she's like walking around the store. She's like, what's this? I was like, man, that is an iPad. She's like, what's that? I was like, bitch, we don't have time. Like, we don't have So I started an iPad, um, yeah, I don't know, like, <laughs> but it's fun because, like I, like, I like to have fun at work when I'm at work because, like, I do a sales pitch, like, when you buy a phone from, like, any carrier, you know they always try to get you to buy cases and screen protectors, right? They always try to get you to, like, so my, my sales pitch is, if you walk out of here without buying a case and a screen protector for your phone, it's like having unprotected sex. And what I realized, a lot of people like unprotected sex. <laughs> like, I don't sound like he's a screen protector, so. Uh. Alright, I got one more joke and then we get out of here. Are, you, are we paying attention to the presidential election and anything like that? Anything? Yeah. Uh, yeah. The real lies Trump is running again? Yes, Trump is running again? Yes, yeah, it's crazy, right? I, man, I, you gonna like this joke because I fucking I don't like Trump. So this is like a lot of people hate Trump and like I just I just think that this generation is pussy because nobody believes in assassinating presidents anymore. Like like back in the day we were like the president, we just got rid of him. You feel me? We just they, they was out of here. You know what I'm saying? Pew. Like now I don't want you to shoot Trump. I do want you to shoot that toupee off his head. Like just take it off. Like all right. No. All right. Got it. Too dark. I lost, nah, fuck that, because I, I lost some people on it, it was like, you talking about killing the president? I don't know. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I got the light, sir, all right, God damn it, I got the light. I'm a Tony, man, have a good night, everybody, thank you very much. Keep going, Tony, man. So, what is, you talking about, uh, DJ, you were supposed to play that shit when I came up with stage. So much. What's the weirdest thing you've Googled and then went down a rabbit hole on? What's the weirdest thing? Uh, weirdest thing I Googled was Blue Waffles. Uh, Blue Waffles? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, that's, 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 that's the stuff I've Like, I went down a rabbit hole and realized it's not a real thing. I know. Mean, yeah, my parents were just trying to scare us when we were kids. That's really what it was. Like, really. I dressed up as a Blue Waffle for uh, Halloween once. That's disgusting. <laughs> I, the weirdest part about that, I dressed up for a guy pussy that night. That's the weirdest part about that. She probably had chlamydia. <laughs> I'm still here. 